All according to plan. What's that? Done and done. You see that? I did as you In asked. In due time. No mistakes. What's that? I did as you asked. I'm listening. Time's not waiting. Adventures call to them. Still here. I am prepared. Grotus awaits us. I won't let you down. What troubles you? You can count on me. The end draws near. Focus on the goal. Oh, sorry. Was lost in thought. What's the hold up? I wrote it like I saw it. I need to concentrate. Becoming distracted leads to becoming dismembered. Oh, no. No. 
Yes, I'm still here. Ready and willing. Just letting the ink dry. I know what to do. I won't let you down. And Lindsay was called forth. My elder sister left. You're late. The Oculus of Abaddon gave me the power to foresee the path to my sister's desire. She is already on her way. Exactly what was destined to happen. My mistress granted me a boon few of my kind could hope for. My body and my soul became a vessel of great power. Tristian, my sister Skylark, betrayed you. He used you to infiltrate Vortikai's lair and bestowed my sister's curse upon him. He stole his treasure, the Oculus of Abaddon, an artifact capable of revealing that which is hidden. The Oculus showed me the hiding place of... No, that is enough. Though your death is assured, such knowledge can wait. An emissary from the First World, a servant to the power that came to these swamps against her will, my duty is a heavy one, but I bear it without faltering. I shall not bow. Not before destiny, not before my enemies, and not before creatures such as you. She's the queen of this horizon and horizons unseen. She's the mistress of dreams and the embodiment of all mortal desires. She is wrath, and she will crush these lands to dust. I serve Nyrissa, mortal. So that was all lies? Save your breath. This Skylark has broken his wings, and now he's useless. I'll rid myself of him after I've finished with you. I won't do that. Besides, why would you need someone who'd lie to you every step of the way, concealing his true goals and his true self? Look at him. Did you know he was once one of my kind? A creature from the Outer Plains? Now all that remains of the sacred servant of Saren Ray is a husk. Why do we want to save him? He is our friend, that's why. She went after what the Oculus of Abaddon revealed to her. She will not return. She has ordered me, the most loyal of all sisters, to remain here and ensure nothing leaves these chambers. You see, these lands were our home long before you appeared. These walls witnessed another mortal who, like you, serves Norissa's goals now. We taught him. We showed him the way. We told him what to believe and whom to serve. My elder sister, Nyrissa, 
She is the mistress of half-truths, exploiting hopes and weaknesses of others with her words. All it took to control Armog was some books and legends about his great destiny. All it took to control Tristan was deceiving him into thinking it was Nyrissa who deprived him of his holy gift. She who cursed him with a mortal body. <sighs> lies. So that was all lies? And all it took to control you, upstart Baron, was a lure. The promise of your own lands to rule. And you bought it. All of you. Enough. You are a thing of the past, and I must rid this place of you, and Tristian. Get ready for oblivion! Let us strike as one! Repent! Tear them apart! This spell's not supposed to work like that. Serves you right. Oh, Saren Ray, I see your light. This should do it. <laughs> You deserved it. So fragile. 
A calculated <laughs> This will hurt. The one who doesn't see evil will destroy the thing that seduces others. Power that can disperse the darkness. Evil incarnate must be destroyed. Merciful Seren Ray Dawn Flower. Hear the prayer from your apostate. I am powerless to fix what I've done, but I can prevent others from following the same road. Grant me courage and light my way in the eternal darkness that awaits. <sighs> the destruction of the Oculus in exchange for eternal darkness. <laughs> There's no worse punishment for Seren Ray's servant than to be deprived of her light forever. But it is fitting for all I have done. Let me tell you something before you decide my fate. Nyrissa is gone. She cannot keep me silent any longer. I'm tired of lies and deception. Our meeting wasn't a coincidence. It was Nyrissa who sent me to the Temple of the Elk. She conjured that fog and sent Jod a version of the place. Since then, I've been watching you, waiting for a time to act for Nyrissa. But that's... that's not all. I helped her create and plant the unwilting flower that almost destroyed your barony. As you can see, everything that happened in Vordekai's tomb was but one of my many crimes. That is all. Deal with me however you think best. I am a Deva. Once a sacred servant and messenger of Saren Ray herself. Once it was my calling to heed mortals' prayers and to deliver them to other servants of the goddess. That was before I fell into a trap set by Nyrissa. She took from me my powers and severed my bond with my goddess. At least, that's what I had thought. Nyrissa threatened that if I didn't serve her, she'd never return my wings, and I'd never speak to Seren Ray again. She made me... She... I'm lying to you again. If it wasn't for my cowardice, Nyrissa would never have broken me to her will. But I... I was afraid to remain mortal. Poor you. It must have been so hard. It's worse than slavery. A nymph. One of the most beautiful of all creatures. Most wicked of all monsters. But who she is, what she wants, I do not know. I ran across her while traveling through the negative energy plane. A strange wound, like something had pierced time and space. In my pride, confident in my powers, I followed its path to this world. She dealt with me in a heartbeat. Before I could flee, she had entrapped me, filling my mind with horrible nightmares. And when I awoke, I was mortal. I... I had no choice. No choice at all. Nyrissa discovered an ancient power awakening beneath the tours of Levanese. She knew of Vordekai, and she also knew of the Oculus. What she did not know is the location of his tomb. The defaced sisters and the Numerian barbarians serving them were dispatched to search for the tomb's entrance. But you found it first. And you would have acquired the Oculus if it were not for me. I don't know. After I failed her, after I failed to destroy you, she became angry with me. The only way to regain her favor was to find the Oculus of Abaddon and bring it to her. I don't know why she wants it. Only that she will destroy anything in her path to possess it, including you. I beg you, be careful. She never forgets any who dare challenge her. 
When I awaked from Nerissa's enchantments, I was mortal, no longer a deva. Nerissa said she'd taken my gift of immortality and severed my bond with my goddess. But, according to what the sister said, I don't understand what's true anymore and what is not. Before this, I thought Nyrissa stood between me and Serenray. But it seems like... It seems like she was lying. No! Just look at him! He's been lied to. And how about lying to your friends with whom you sit by the fire and fight shoulder to shoulder? I haven't seen such nastiness in a long time. And he pretended to be this goody-goody. This was Nyrissa's creation. A strange plant with seeds that bring death to the mortals and open gates to the first world. I don't know much else. All I've done was use my knowledge of the planes to root the flower in two worlds simultaneously. <coughs> what Nyrissa did was deplorable. But I am not blameless. Seren Ray as my witness. I didn't want it to happen as it did. But in my fear of losing her divine light, my resolve crumbled. So I did what I was ordered to do. Partly. Nyrissa charmed the first faithful. Promised him and all his followers a paradise in exchange for your head. My job was to lure you to the trap. But Nyrissa ordered me only to lure you to the trap. She never forbade me to protect you. That's why I fought by your side in that battle. <sighs> only you can decide, but I'd never be able to trust a traitor. Never. you and head for the city. A walk will help me to figure out how I can make amends for... for everything. Adventures call to that. 